buzz around the world. A shocking new video, you've likely seen it, allegedly, shows U.S. Marines urinating on the bodies of Taliban militants. This is a blurred out photo from a piece of that video. Right now, reaction is pouring in from around the world. Afghan President Hamid Karzai has expressed outrage. Arizona Senator John McCain says the video is not representative of the fine men and women who make up our military. The fear is the video will be used as a terrorist tool to whip up anger against the United States. ABC 15 now wants to know your reaction to this video. And once again, our guest today is ABC News' John Quinones. We appreciate you being here. You. I know you have been to um, Afghanistan, or to Iraq. Mm -hmm. You were there on your own. It's very dangerous. Well, I was with a crew reporting and on behalf of ABC mm -hmm. News, but we weren't embedded, which meant we were uh, just journalists driving a van that had the words TV news on it. Mm. Of course, uh, the Iraqis could have thought we were spies, and the Americans could have thought we were Iraqis under disguise. So it was, it was <laughs> cat and mouse Either game. way, yes. a very dangerous situation. Yeah. This whole thing reminds me of the Abu Ghraib prison scandal. It brings you back yeah. to that. <gasps> oh, my mm -hmm. goodness. It's just a stupid move by a very few members of the military. And, of course, it doesn't represent, as Senator McCain said, everyone. But it's ammunition for the bad guys, for our enemies. They'll take this and run with it, and they'll be all over the Internet, and it'll even you know, spark more hatred toward the U.S. And so many people feel like, as military soldiers, we know this is a tough job. We are certainly not taking light what any of these men and women are doing no. to protect our freedoms. However, there is a level of dignity that we have to maintain. Absolutely. I don't know what these guys were thinking. And then to actually take a picture of it if not video. Yeah, we don't know their ranking. We no. don't know how long they've been in, how old they were. I mean, that doesn't, of course, excuse it, no. but it's just what kind of mentality level they're at. No. What, what, why would they do something like that? The good that? news is the military is investigating it. Right. I'm sure we'll, we'll come up with some answers. And you yeah. talked about the fear while you were there, you know, yeah. you driving around in, in, a, in a truck that said TV journalism yeah. on it. These guys and these men and women are in harm's way. And this may heighten the level of their own security. How so? Do you think they will have uh, some ramifications? There will be more anger. I mean, the word will get out that this is what the, it's the ultimate insult to, to the bodies mm -hmm. of the fallen on whichever side. And yeah, I think people are going to get angrier and you might see a reaction to it. But John, as you mentioned, the military investigates. And as we saw with Abu Ghraib, mm -hmm. of course, you know, those who are convicted, there is punishment that, you know, they will pay for what they've done. So mm -hmm. this is not something you know, that that's, they're going to get away with. Right. Well, here's what you all are saying on Facebook. Sherry Spirek says, I think it is sad, but not knowing what our military goes through on a daily basis doesn't give us the right to judge them. Bradley Sisko writes, it makes the U.S. look bad, mm -hmm. and it will spark more anti-American sentiment around the globe. Brandy Barron, after all that they are expected to endure to protect others and to survive while doing it, all I say, good for them. Wow. Well, mm -hmm. Jennifer Kreese Turner, we are not over there. We do not understand the trauma that these guys are going through. Do I agree with it? No, but again, I will not judge these boys. Let's go back to what Brandy Barron yeah. said. She says, good for them. She understands, she says, you know, these, these guys, are what they see and what they have to do day in and day out and the, the, the terror and danger they're under, she can, under, she can understand this. Yeah, I don't agree with that. I think you, you're, you have to maintain a certain amount of professionalism. So never condone something like no, this. Let's be above not. it. I can't yeah. imagine. All right. Well,